this thing has changed our lives, and the way that we communicate with us is going to be mm -hmm. today's big, big deal. Big deal. Oh. So, I'm going to tell you right now, I, I'm not big on having phone conversations. If you're calling me on the phone, it's an emergency. It's like you got to talk to me right now, and it's a serious. <laughs> really? Idea. Yeah. If you want to just like find something out, like what I'm doing tonight or whatever, you text me. Okay. And if it's something that's not urgent, and I can get to this tomorrow or later in the week, email me. Okay. Uh -huh. That's how I am. Right. Mm -hmm. I'm not, I don't want to talk, first of all, I, I don't want to have this on but next to my brain, like the radiation. Oh you my You can wear gosh, your headphones, that really is not an excuse. I always just, okay, so what do you guys think about the way you communicate? Let's start with the most millennial millennial. Okay. Okay, because everyone, everyone's millennial here, but, but <sighs> I'm, not me, but you are, so <laughs> explain to me how millennials do communication in the modern day. All right, so while, while I agree with, with the texting makes things easier, I, nice. I do think that calling on the phone is a lost art, not only because it conveys emotion better, mm -hmm. yes. but also because it's good to hear a voice, you know, right. and not be so consumed with my phone all the time. However, <laughs> most of us do text. There's not a lot of phone calls that go on, and even me saying that, I don't usually call my friends. Now, there is a little caveat where FaceTime, because yeah. it rings longer, I mm -hmm. often use FaceTime if I need to get a hold of someone. So, so FaceTime will, the other person's phone will ring about twice as long as a normal phone call. Are you kidding? Which gives, them, which gives me a better opportunity to get in touch with them. Right. Does that make sense? Yeah, it makes sense. I mean, I think it also depends if you live far away from the people you care for. Mm -hmm. um, in my personal case, I FaceTime with my mom all the time. And I have some friends that I have a deeper connection with or maybe I want to get to know better. And then if they're far away, which happen to be a lot of those, uh, you know, back in Mexico, then I will try to do either FaceTime or a call. So, I mean, with people that are here in LA, it's what are you gonna do, da da da, yes, texting. But sometimes I'm having a conversation with a very good friend and then we're texting for what, 45 minutes? And it's like, if we would have talked on the right. phone for 20, no, I agree with you. Listen, better. So here's the thing, so, sometimes yeah. I will have a friend that will- I need to see the face, you're right. yeah. you know. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I will have a friend that will text me something that qualifies for a phone call. I'm, like, I'm not gonna, I'm <laughs> yeah, not gonna text, right. just get on the phone. This is, oh, yeah. There's a lot going on here, let's just get on the phone. I was actually shocked this week because <laughs> I was like, uh, Facebooking with somebody, just like texting them, and then he actually called me, and I'm like, oh my god, he called me? Like, I love that. It was a yeah, little bit great. shocking, you know? And well, <laughs> Go ahead. No, no, I'll just say, I feel bad for my mom because, you know, she'll call me and have these long, we'll have these long conversations, and I, oh. I love talking to my mom. But then she'll text me something equally as long, so it's like, for, oh. you know, it isn't even, at that point, at a yeah. certain length, of, right. of something that you have to say, it is, well you gotta call. And but it that, depends with who, because I'm sorry, some adults take so long for texting. Like my yes. mom is literally typing, or my dad, my dad, <laughs> sorry dad, I love you, but he's typing for hours, and I'm like, okay, what's he saying, what's he saying? Uh, and when I, it's like two lines, and it's like, really, you took this long? Just call me if it's right. so hard to text, and we can, you know, speed it up. I think some people have also up. become a little bit dumber, because I'm gonna call, call this out. So, like, <laughs> there's this app called WhatsApp that you yeah. have on your phone. I have to use it. And so, the best? people, well, I think people are just, like, they're using a little too much because I have some people that are like, mandamelo por el WhatsApp, send it to me through WhatsApp, and I'm like, uh, guys, sending something through WhatsApp unless you're in another country is the same thing as a text message. Like, why the hell would I want to send it because specifically it's through WhatsApp? It's More than a text message. Why do you guys like Regular WhatsApp one? so much? Because I had to start I using it because I'm working with a guy in Spain and like he's like, oh, I don't want to pay the bill. So that's the reason why I love it. Like WhatsApp, I literally have it's just changed it's my just life. Text. But it's nah, just text. Uh -uh. It's text, it's calls, and it's face calls. Really? So it's I everything. Can face call with the WhatsApp. You can, and, and you have to be in oh, Wi-Fi. So but every time I go to Mexico, it. that's what I okay, use. Okay, for and international. But my mom that lives in New Jersey, she'll call me through WhatsApp and not through the my regular phone. I'm like, what? You know why? Because it doesn't cost her anything. No, we have unlimited. Okay, she fine. hasn't gotten that memo. <laughs> One thing, going back to you <laughs> saying that you like to call, because I know this about you because we've talked about it, is that sometimes you make jokes that the tone of the joke doesn't Bro, come across. Bro, 100 oh. million percent, especially with girls, someone I'm trying to attract, it's impossible. Uh -huh. my, my voice and my being is not conveyed properly through text. Right. I need, I really need to be with the girl or whoever I'm talking to for them to understand, like, and I'm sure it happens with you too because right. we have, you know, very different uh, eclectic senses of humor, and often people misunderstand us. And plus, you know what, with, with the call, you don't give people time to think their answers. With right. texting, oh. especially with someone that you like, you can oh, be like, David, hold on, our director's calling. Uh-oh, what happened? Hey, hey, what's up? <laughs> He's got a face really? on. Okay. <laughs> oh! Hi, Luca! Oh, my gosh! <laughs> By the way, Luca, Our who's producers the producer, the, the executive producer of the show, uh -huh. um, he says that, uh, wait, say it into my microphone. 
We can't hear it. It's hear it. No, he was saying away. that you were making fun of the old geezers. Because what is this phone, Humberto? Seriously. I said, it's an old Samsung Galaxy. <laughs> I just me. It's not working. Oh, man, we're back in 20, 2012. I was going to make a joke about older people. But I, can't. I know. What is this? A Samsung, it's a Samsung 1A? Well, because the new Samsung Galaxies Jesus blow up in your face, yeah, so I decided to stay. The, they blow up. No, no. no the they, iPhone they 7 those. now, and you have this Hold thing. Hold on, let me just, yeah, let me just Seriously. go. Oh, there, you're hanging out? Yeah, okay, say hi. It's legit, we're not anyway, making this up. Anyway, if you want to make a connection with someone on a deeper level, you should call, you should FaceTime, you should, call, you yeah. should seek yes. that connection because texting puts it all in further distance. Mm. I well, don't... there are some people that, you know, it's so weird. You'll call you'll call them, they won't answer. You break but the eyes with the text. they will answer through a text. I'm like, are you kidding me? Like, I feel like that's a little bit that's of Umberto. a slap in the he face. He doesn't like talking. <laughs> the thing is that, listen, I'm extroverted, but people confuse that with being social. When I leave here, I actually don't want to be bothered by anybody. And, and, and my co-producer, Andres, will, will agree with this. Sometimes calling can be a little intrusive. But